anime, I'm going to go with it to anyone else. I'm the only one who did anime. I made a direct anime reference. He made Hamtaro on accident. This is on the show. the wrong one. And hey, welcome to Board AF! Yay! Guys, this is not just any Board AF. This is our first sponsored live Board AF! Yes, sir. Oh. Oh. Brought to you by Games by Bicycle. Tattoo Stories. Thanks to these guys. Big shout out to them for sponsoring the episode. And here's how the game works. This is Tattoo Stories, the drawing party game where your art skills don't really matter. Everyone is a tattoo artist and one player acts as a customer. The customer chooses five elements that the artist then has to incorporate into their design. Artists then have three minutes to ask the customer questions and draw their design. But much like a tattoo, they cannot erase. <laughs> The artists present their design to the customer, and the customer distributes cards to each artist who implemented each element the best. The player with the most cards at the end of the game wins. For those of you who want to also buy the game, it is available on Amazon right now. And uh, the folks at Bicycle actually want you guys to contribute. So you draw your own tattoos, send them to us. Draw your designs, use the hashtag, uh, what is it? Draw a tattoo, pretty simple. And the best one done, Spencer will get it tattooed on his body. Right, Spencer? <laughs> I, I don't care. I'll get, I'll get anything tattooed at this point. All right, so everyone get your tattoo stories oh, board. Oh, I will be so the first one. All right, so Matt, you have to pick 10 I'm cards. Draw 10 cards and then I'm gonna pick like. five I like. All right. I'm gonna race and you won't be able to know. Seven, eight, eight nine, nine ten. ten. He can count! Wow. All right, here we go. Here are my five. Here we go. All right. Okay. Landmark. Oh. Landmark. Sensor bar. Oh. Sensor bar. The third one is skull. Skull. It's gonna be a badass tattoo, y'all. The fourth one is patriotic. Patriotic. Oh. This is ugly. And the fifth one is the sun. The sun. The sun. All right. Can we ask you questions? You can ask me we... questions that, but within the three minutes. So you ready to start the timer? Yes, three minutes. Three minutes, you can ask start. me questions as the customer, feel free. Now, what's your favorite landmark? Ooh, my favorite landmark has gotta be the world's biggest ball of yarn. Okay. <laughs> okay, no erasing, remember? No erasing, you can't erase tattoos. What does Using patriotic mean to me. you? What tattoo Matt? should I get? What does patriotic mean to me? Yeah. Just, uh, just a flag. Who'd you vote for? Hmm? <laughs> Spencer, that's between me and Kanye. All right, I'm actually done. All right. We have one minute and 10 seconds. What's it like being so slow and bad at drawing, everybody? Excuse me? I Excuse said, what's it like me? being so slow Spencer, and bad? Spencer, points deducted for cockiness, I'm sorry. <laughs> Three, two, one. No, there's still five cards. One. All right, there are five cards here. Everyone is gonna present their tattoo, and then I get to give them as many cards as I want based on whether I feel like they kind of checked off that uh, that that design or not. I guess we'll start with Spencer since he was first as he gloated. <laughs> Tell us so the story. So this is the, uh, Whoa! Whoa. So Mount the, Rushmore? Yeah, Mount from? Rushmore. It's uh, But it's made of skulls, so it's patriotic, it's a landmark, and it's got the rising sun behind it. I don't know, okay. it's orientation, uh, oh. compass-wise. What about uh, sensor, though? I decided to uh, opt out of that one. Wow. Interesting All right. choice. All right. Strategy, Maybe that's why you're fast, because you decided to opt out. Yeah, Four out of five one. ain't bad. Yeah. You know what's better? Five out of five. We'll see when we get to you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, well, I'm glad you asked. This is uh, a, a skeleton. It's mm -hmm. naked. That's why he's got the sensor bar. Those lines wow. are going to hold up. He's, uh, she's waving the American flag. That is the arch in St. Louis. And then the title of this tattoo is Taking Mom to St. Louis because um, it's the son that's taking the mom to. Uh, it's spelled S U N. Yeah, Explicitly. but it, it, creative license. Okay, um, so, that, so, okay. so you're saying that's a lady skeleton. Yeah, that, that, yeah. but but the but uh, the boob bones, yeah, well, you know, the boob this bones is, is just free. Yeah, yeah, the boob bones. You can yeah. show boob bones. You can show yeah, the yeah, boob bones. I love you're it. The boob show. Show. You guys are very good at drawing skeletons. Yeah. I'll have to say. I was that. excited about the skulls. Skulls could be hard. Uh, yeah. Iffy. My best friend. Woo. Well, I can't wait to blow your socks off because I title this piece The United Skulls of America. Whoa. Yeah. What's more patriotic than the White House? But if the White House was a skull oh, with the sun really rising badass. behind it. Really really and 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 Punisher school. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And you know, we had to censor out the Punisher. United Skulls of America because it was too hard. <laughs> too hardcore. <laughs> Courtney? Scary. So what I Whoa. did. Statue of Liberty, and she's showing her little titties. Uh -huh. She is. Uh, yeah. And what she's censor? also censoring her eyes because it's like, Justice, Justice is, is blind. blind. That is a thing. Um, 
also, <laughs> there's the sun and the skull here because it's all like life and death. It doesn't matter. We all live and die anyway. So show your ears. Get your yayas out. Excellent. Show Thank them things. Let's freedom ring. Sarah, let's see how you checked off all five things. All right, I also checked off all of the five prompts, and I also now included I feel like a dummy. your favorite landmark, the ball of yarn. Oh. Oh. Unravel this. So we have a skull made out of the ball of yarn, and he's glowing like the sun. She was listening. We have the um, American flag right behind him, and there's a sensor bar in his mouth. But what's he saying? What's he saying? I can't say anything right now because uh, I'm trying sensor. to keep this family friendly. Uh, mm. Okay, this is, man, really <laughs> the graduation here. Um, okay, so I can give as many cards to people as I want. If you don't give me the landmark or I did the his gateway favorite landmark. to the West, right. you're gonna piss off so many people in St. Louis. Here's the thing, all right, here's the thing. I do feel like Sarah nailed the landmark. I accept that. Because it is my favorite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine. I, I kind of want to give her the skull as well because she incorporated Ooh. the skull and into the landmark. Into into yeah. okay. However, I'm digging the vibe of this Castle Grayskull nice. patriotic cool. White House feel. Good. Yeah. Last However, two points. Courtney did a really good job of censoring part of a body that you're not supposed to show, which is technically what should be censored. <laughs> Here's your, here's your problem, buddy. You said she, and then you only gave a pelvic sensor. So oh. I feel like just because of sensitivity, I gave it to Courtney. Also, the underboob is great. The underboob sells it. The underboob yeah. sells, it. sells it. And then, Spencer, you get the sun. Yeah! Oh. What if I were to tell you that that was a rising sun and not That's an not how rising suns work two either. Points. You don't know that. All right, so Ian, you are the next <laughs> customer. All right. Oh my gosh, Ian's finally getting a tattoo. Finally. Oh my gosh. All right, first one is Roman numerals. Oh. A, a standard, yeah. a standard Basic. tattoo practice. Oh. Basic, then Victorian wig. I'm a deus. Then, baby version. <laughs> <laughs> Flying saucer. Jeez, man. This does sound like a tattoo. <laughs> and then, <laughs> Inspirational. All right, three minutes starts and now. What is your favorite Roman numeral? Oh, 1,799. You're mode. such a troll. What is so, that? Is that M MCM, well, MCM XX, IXX? If you were to get a tattoo, what would you get, Ian? I'd get strong bad. <laughs> Actually, Trogdor would actually be kind of dope. Because I thought it was so good. All right, I would like to start with Sarah. Okay, hello. Welcome, customer Ian, yeah, sorry, to my no, tattoo no. shop. This is what I've brought to you. It's a uh, baby alien puzzle freaks. Wow. Oh. So it's a baby alien in a flying saucer pandering. with a... Yeah, with a, a lot of this pandering. Whole Game's about pandering, dude. About You're pandering giving the customer the what they want. So he's wearing a little Victorian wig, he's in a flying saucer, and there's an inspirational, inspirational quote on there. Um, Where? It's Ian XIV, Puzzle Freaks! I don't think that's don't the think Roman that's numeral I was looking for. Puzzle Freaks, so that is my drawing. I will not accept your negative comments. Yeah. yeah that's a very cute baby. Thank alien. you, he's very he's very cute. I want an attitude check, attitude check before I present my tattoo. Mm -hmm. I would love an optimistic client, please. Positivity. You came to my tattoo shop, that means you wanted my art. <laughs> True. I haven't even seen yours yet, so I will. Well, then why'd you I walk will, in my shop? I'm gonna withhold my judgment until I see it. This is a little baby in a saucer, and basically it's one of our forefathers in a spaceship going somewhere, saying, "You're almost there." Is that Andrew it's, Jackson? It's a silly symbolism of we're so young on this universe, and we really think that we're getting so far when. We're stealing alien spaceships. Whoa. There's conspiracies about us. I like the diaper details. The right. diaper deets are Tommy very Pickle good. Tommy Pickle style. He has a very strong nose. This is exactly what you wanted, right? I, I like it. Mine is about looking deeper. It's going beyond just the literal words you said, mm. going to the heart. So okay. that's why I have alien baby Antoinette walking on the beach. And as you can see, there were once two sets of footsteps. <laughs> And then there's one set of footsteps, and that's when the baby, uh, the baby alien was carrying you. And I went ahead and gave you the Roman numeral, numeral for thirty, because you know it's a sexy number. Cause triple it's X. X, 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 triple X. I did yeah, that yeah. too. Some good submissions, Matt. Ian, 2020 has been hard, man. Imagine in the new year, how cool it would be if we just got abducted by aliens, which okay. is why this inspirational picture 
of Baby New Year being abducted. <laughs> Shut up, being abducted by. What is that face? That is a tiny Victorian Bram Stoker Why are Dracula its hair. We're <laughs> 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 no. not seeing Bram Stoker's Dracula. Yeah, you that's have. The wig. Yeah, that's you the have. Wig. This is the wig. Yeah, I know yeah, this. Funny Hotel Transylvania Two makes that. <laughs> that's true. It yeah. does. Baby so, New Year. I think we could stop the count now. I think I've won. You know, you make a you make a very compelling argument, but I need to withhold my decision fair, until fair. I've seen fair. all submissions. Mm, fair. Also, ch yeah. someone on chat wants to point out that's not a baby. Baby. What? Look at the diaper. <laughs> Babies are tall sometimes. It looks more like Beethoven twerking. That baby was LeBron James. Wow. Well, you gotta hold it up. You gotta hold it up. Stay your case, what does it my say dude. In there? Who am I, okay, uh, well, it says hang in there. You know, Aww. Aww. Prototypical, you know, I feel like none of these really hit the inspirational. Mm. Uh, the footsteps? New it's Year. Too subtle. Baby I think. New Year. You're gonna have people Puzzle asking freaks? you to explain that left and right. This no, just no says one... hang in there. People no, we all see know it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all know the sense. Okay, uh, it's Well, I think the rest speaks for itself. <laughs> All right, uh, ladies and gents, I have made my decision. There's only one person that wrote a very inspirational message on here, and that was "Hang in there." Oh, so I have to give that. it's a classic. To Spencer for baby version. I have to give it to Iffy because oh, that is dude. a beautiful. Oh. Look at that baby. Look Imagine that, that baby crawling details. at you from the ceiling. I'm a baby. <laughs> trust, trust me, I'm a baby. <laughs> for a Victorian wig, I give it to Sarah. Yeah, oh. I saw that Oh, For flying saucer, yep. I give it to Courtney. Wow. Wow. For Roman numerals, he didn't know it, but he wrote my favorite number in Roman numerals, and that's eight. So I gotta give it to hey. Matt. Everyone what's, gets one what's point. What's the same thing? Wow. Eight? Eight's my favorite number. Everyone really? got a point. Everybody yeah. gets a point. Look at us. Okay, meme lord. What you got? Barbed wire. Barbed, Barbed wire. wire. A classic speech slash thought bubble. Oh. Okay. Right. Halo. Oh. Halo. Halo or Halo? It's Halo. Crosshairs. Crosshairs. Cross and eating. Eating. All right, three minutes. Three gang. minutes on the clock. What's your favorite food, buddy? It's so mood dependent. How much do you like burgers? I love a burger. How much do you love I pizza? I love burgers. Love, also love pizza. How about burger pizza? I've had it and it's great. Cheeseburger pizza? Mm -hmm. Two. One. Time's up, gang. <laughs> it's over for you guys. <laughs> so mine's a period piece. Whoa. It's an angel that's crossing no man's land in World War One. As you can see, the barbed wire right there. Jesus. Here's a sniper that has the angel in his crosshairs, and he's eating a, a Slim Jim. And snapping into a Slim Jim. He's please. snapping into a Slim Jim, and the thought bubble says, is that an angel crossing no man's land? Do I shoot? Like, would you? <laughs> And that's what tattoos should do, bro. They, they should make, make you, think. you think. They make you think. <laughs> like, what would you do? They should provoke. Exactly. Oh this my provokes. God. Picture this. <laughs> Frankenstein. Oh. But he's, he's super mad because there's pineapple on that pizza and he's shaking his barbed wire wrapped fist and oh. he's screaming. Is that kid? Grr. Yeah. Yeah, everyone knows Frankenstein, a hardcore boxer, and he would wrap his fists in barbed wire before going into bare knuckle fights. Not to be that guy, but yeah, it's Frankenstein's, monster. Frankenstein's monster. monster. Hey, that's a pretty good drawing, I'm gonna have to say. Hey, thanks, he's so mad at that pineapple so pizza. Good. That's my drawing. <laughs> this is a monster. I want you to transport back to the early McDonald ads when they used an anthropomorphic hamburger okay. to okay. advertise what was their his foods. Name? I don't know, where is he? The He's in jail. He was a criminal. Funny you should say this. Picture this. He's in jail. Oh! <laughs> There's barbed wire. He's a strong burger but he's man. He's also dead because he has a halo over his oh, head. No. Crosshairs are on him at any second because why? He's the most wanted. He's not happy about it, so that's why his that thoughts are sad. Oh, that's, that's pretty badass. Person. That's pretty, pretty cool. Badass. Pretty hard. Okay, I drew an angel baby. Whoa. With a barbar halo, and they're saying, <laughs> I can't, I'm a bad bitch. And there's a pizza on the floor because she can't eat the pizza because she's no. not basic. That's very cute. You got two two birds with one stone with that barbed wire or halo. Yeah, that, yeah. Was, that, was, pretty, that was pretty impressive. Yeah, I, think I may or may not have done it, but Courtney and I were cheating after each other. No. So this is my tattoo. Ooh. Oh, now, uh, it's a little kitty because you and I are both cat 
parents people. She's Stop trying proud. to pander. <laughs> Literally the point of the freaking game. game. You want to personalize, personalize the, tattoo the tattoo for All the right. customer. Fine. Fine, I'll personalize so, next time. Uh, this little kitty has a barbed wire halo because, as we all know, cats can be angels sometimes, but they can also be little buttheads. Mm -hmm. He's about to eat a little salami, and out he's saying out loud, little salami. Little, uh, the cats can have little And salami. if you see his whiskers and his little hair on his head, that's like the crosshairs. I was kind of going for like the hairy part oh. of the kitty. So that's my little salami tattoo. I haven't talked about this publicly, but uh, I love salami. Why would you say something so controversial? Yeah, dude, brave? so brave. <laughs> uh, All right. Speech, uh, I'm going to give it to Ian because, you know, wow. it's a it's, uh, picture's worth a thousand words, but words, words are worth, worth a thousand, thousand pictures. A thousand <laughs> words are worth a thousand words. Uh, crosshairs. Did you have crosshairs? <laughs> yeah, nobody has crosshairs That's the most except wanted. for if Matt he... just points I put crosshairs. Broadly. I don't know if those were invented. In World War I. Were they? On a scope? I don't I know. Red, Call of Duty, Red, World Red War Dead I. Redemption. They, they do. Had, they Good had a point. scope. Good point. Yeah. You guys are... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's salami. Yeah. yeah. Courtney's halo, I might have to give her the barbed wire and the halo. <gasps> because it's a, just like a really good looking barbed wire. Wow, wow, we will. Mm, wow. Thank yeah. you. Well, he hasn't done it yet. Okay. I, I yet. said maybe. It's okay if you don't. I want it to be an even game. Wow. 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 The thought of someone punching pizza with bar a barbed wire so fist. So mad about it. Pretty funny. All right, I want you guys to go really if hard. Still Use fresh. your creativity for this. Okay. Just rub it off. First one, bathroom item. Mm, All right. Like a toilet Hold or on. a sandwich. The second prompt you have to incorporate is monkey. Ooh. Monkey on a toilet. Third, anime. Then the anime. Uh, slang slash common phrase. Oh, all okay. right. And then you have heart. All my drawings have heart. Time starts in three, a two, a one. Sarah, do you or do you not have a panini press in your bathroom? I do not have a panini Damn, press in my bathroom. My I don't have any any food um, Why not? items in my. You bathroom. don't believe in efficiency? Mm -mm. All right, your time is up, and I want to start with Spencer first. Good thing I nailed it. <laughs> Oh. We got a monkey. Oh my god, it's so cute. He's so happy and he's Aww, so he's done a, a very uh, a very anime style. Yeah, he's got toilet paper and he's saying wipe out. Wipe out. Oh my god, that's so good. So Sarah, you know how you told me that I needed to pander? I've decided to pander as well. Uh -huh. So it just says Sarah is the most lit cat mom. Got a heart, got a plunger. You gotta try to incorporate. I got, I got monkey. What is the thing in the lower right? That, that's supposed to be that's a monkey. Anime. That's anime. That's anime. That's anime. <laughs> that's just an assortment of things. I'm hating. Well, Ian. isn't that all tattoos? Just an assortment of things? Ian, why would Sarah ever get My that? My body's on a her temple. Body? Anyway, are you familiar with the anime form Higao? Wow. So this is an Higao monkey. Oh, yeah. I see. And he's hairy, as a monkey would be. He's thinking about how much he loves poop, oh. which is a bathroom item. It's a heart, and then is there ooh, ooh, ooh. Above it, he's thinking ooh, ooh. Oh, I'm very proud of you, Matt. Thank That's you. very good. Thanks, that onion Sarah. monkey, next onion level. Onion monkey. Ify, what's your tattoo for me? This is a tattoo that needs to capture it all, which is why this is a flag that you would wear. Oh. That is the Monkey D. Luffy flag from One Piece in oh. anime. Yeah. With a plunger oh. and a toilet scrubber and hearts to match. That's pretty and right cool. under it, it says, it's lit! It's very interesting oh, that it. two people yeah, chose it. lit for slang. It's the only slang that I know. Um, That's nice, Courtney. Courtney. I drew a little lovable <gasps> baby monkey with a little sparkly eyes, like trying to be like a little anime baby monkey. Aww. And he yeah, said, you monkey. clogged Aww. my heart. That's so I'm just gonna say that cute. it looks more like an ape than a monkey. All right, you guys all did very well. Hearts, I think I'm going to give it to Courtney, because she got the most like lovable oh, hearts on there. Thank you. you the monkey, I'm very torn, because there's actually three monkeys that I really love. I actually so do really like Matt's onion monkey. Onion monkey? I really like Spencer's monkey, and I really like Courtney's. I mean, I really feel like you're snubbing one. I, I totally understand why you're <laughs> skipping this, but I get it. I think the monkey I'm actually gonna go with is Matt. Nice. Wow. Onion, onion monkey. monkey. Onion monkey. Not happy the about it. Bathroom item. I love Ify's use of the bathroom item uh, behind. Uh, whatever, stupid. For anime, I'm gonna to go with. Anyone else? What is it, enemy? I'm the 
only no, one who did anime. No, no, I made a direct no. anime reference. He made Hamtaro on accident. <laughs> this is on the same the wrong one. I, I get it, Iffy, and oh. I, I hope that we can work through this. There's one more point. Ian, move the move anime what? to Spencer's drawing. Why, Why would I do that? It. You gave me that card. Oh. Common phrase. I'm going to give it to Matt for ooh. Oh, wow. 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 I would have yeah, given it to Spencer yeah, for Wipeout. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Wipeout. Wow. The anime I like how we, we, we gave Don't worry. Yeah. crap to Sarah for pandering. Ian just pandered and got zero points. <laughs> I know. This is this is rigged. That was okay, gang. Rigged? I want to tattoo my brainstorming vibes are as follows. Big cat. <laughs> Big cat. Big cat. Big cat. Tree. Big cats love trees. Fruit. Trees are in fruit. Fruits are in trees. Trees are in fruit. Steampunk. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> Flat. I thought she said flack. Me yeah, too. We're gonna give, give it flack. Okay, and what kind of big cat are we talking? Like, oh wait, let me start like, the timer. Are we talking like? Are we talking say, like? Love... Are we saying like African big cat or, or like, like or North American big cat? South Asia has some good big cats. That's like really this, cool. Like the Siberian tiger. North America. What kind of what kind of tree are we talking? Deciduous or coniferous? <laughs> Hey, that's a question. Why do you know question. so much about cat? He I will doesn't. say I don't care so much about the flag prompt. Damn it. <laughs> okay, so you're saying fruit. Now, what kind of fruit are you talking? Are you talking like you're talking like fruit out of a tree? Where else do they grow, Ian? All right, so fruit. Like, Could you just draw fur? your goddamn yeah. front? Oh, I'm almost done. I'm done. almost done. All right, time's up, gang. What? Here is my little flag for Courtney. Ooh. So Damn, it has familiar. it has many many elements. It's a little flag waving in the in the air, and it has stars. But it has a little lion dressed up in steampunk Ooh, wear, Renaissance style, dressed. little cleavage showing. And then um, this this little steampunk uh, he has goggles mm. on, and the, um, is picking fruit from a tree. Wow! So here's the little flag of all the things. I love it. I like that you put the fruit into the tree. Thank you. So you're saying like a flag that would feature all of the things that yeah, were listed on the card would be I was a stellar thinking. tattoo. That was and what like, if I was, there was thinking. Out of all of these, if there were no one who had a single anime reference. Are you gatekeeping Hamtar? <laughs> 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 that was on purpose. All right, Ify, what That's do you awesome. have? What I have is uh, just a lion just sitting back oh. in the jungle, the mighty jungle. Ooh. He's sipping on some grapes, and you know he's on the tree. Got a flag in the back. That is good. And then, and then in the back, you see a little steampunk bike just flying. Is that ET? Flying by. Yeah, it's 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 engineered technically by steampunk. Courtney, let me let me teleport you to a fictional past town where technology is advanced, but the people might not be. This is the mayor. The southern region of the United States. Now he's a cat who's a mayor, and. You can tell that he's oh the mayor. Oh my god, it's so cute. Because he has a little Bapple on top of his head, and everyone knows Bapples. I don't think you've ever watched trees. anime. No. He's got the goggles on his head. He's a big cat. He's the mayor of this town. Apples grow on trees. That's about as big as cats can be. That's yeah. about as big as cats that can be. Is. And he's got kind of like a, you talking to me? That's really cute. Bapples be. Ian? <laughs> well, okay, so I was going to do the prompt, but then I watched this VHS. I just, I, I, I... Go over broke. Just go over broke. Seven days. Seven days. Oh, no. Sucks for you, dude. It's a good anime. I think there's a fruit in that little scribble Looks there. Like a, that could be an orange. That's a grapefruit. Well, sorry, you have to die in seven days now. You want to loan it out? Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, mine's, mine's kind of wow. like iffy. Wow! Uh, you got a jaguar. 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 Uh, it's hanging in a, a tree. You know, it's not the most correct banana tree, but I did put some bananas up there. The flag and the uh, steampunk, uh, what, what do you call those? But like, Zeppelin. Yeah, yeah, like a, but where they have the, the carriage underneath that kind of hangs. I was Zeppelin. thinking I was thinking Mummy Returns. Yeah, I think it is. A, yeah, it's, yeah. It's called a Mummy Returns. It's uh, called Rocketeer. The, yeah, it's called the Mummy Returns. That's fine. They call that a Zeppelin. I, we've got some really good contenders here, none of which I will ever actually put on my skin. Dude, flag? I'm gonna give it to Sarah. Heck she yeah. killed yeah. it. Well, that's Great yes. flag. Yeah, Courtney said she didn't care about a flag. Yeah, well, she had to give it, the point but a flag is a flag, you know? Yeah. You, know what? you know what, let's just uh... No! <laughs> Oh. No erasing stuff. That'll Spencer. be $400 per I'm doing session. It. Tree? I think I gotta give it to Iffy. Oh, oh, I agree. That's I a solid tree. Yeah. That is a really cool solid tree. tree. The, um, Steampunk. I have to give it to Bapples B. Bapples B! Bapples B is so cute. He's got goggles. Yeah. And then Big Cat. 
<laughs> that doesn't look like a cat mat. It really does look like a mouse, but it's still just as cute. It's I will very just say. Cute. Okay, I'm gonna give Big Cat to Spencer because that's a great cat. Yeah. Cat. I love it. It'll be the page in a magazine. Like a jaguar. Yeah, like a highlights magazine. Jaguar. Mm. Yeah, it's really tough with the fruit. I freaking love apples. Be it's so cute, and then there's so many apples on the street. But the grapes. But the grapes make me want to eat the grapes. Ooh. So I gotta give All it to right. Ian. Yeah. 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 Ian, I'm can't so argue, sorry. You have to die in seven results. days. So we have enough time to do Iffy's tattoo. We gotta do Iffy's tattoo. Yes. yes, so normally you would go two full rounds, but for timing's sake, we are going to end on Iffy's turn. Whoever has the most points. Where are we at points wise right now? Ian, how you doing? I don't want to talk about it. All right, pick five, Iffy. Guys, I think I have a chance of coming back. I think you might. Shark. Mm. Bowser. Oh, oh. Sure. Oh. Now I can, Shark. And now I know. Motorcycle. Check wow. it out. I could draw a motorcycle. Motorcycle. Wow. Kind of like a baby, right? Boxing gloves. Boxing Damn. gloves. Right. How would he even wear them? On the fins. Jumping. Jumping. Uh -huh, it's, yeah. This just writes itself. Yeah, Tattoo it writes yeah. itself. Board game reference. Board, Board game, game reference. reference. Three oh, minutes. This motorcycle. Start. Right now, what's your favorite board game, Iffy? I'd say tattoo stories. Yeah. <laughs> I'd honestly say bicycle playing cards. You could do whatever you want with them. I've never drawn a shark before. I used to, sharks were my favorite animal growing up. Oh, okay, so now I'm what kind of motorcycle are we talking? Are we talking like a Hayabusa or are we talking Ooh, like a cruiser? That's, that's a good question. I'm talking I'm, a mini Grom. As much as I like the Busa, I'm thinking of or a like cruiser. like a Jixer? Something like a Honda Mocha. Okay, what about a Grom? <laughs> like a, like a, <laughs> a, a Grom works, a Grom works. All right, I, was, I want a Grom so bad. Yeah. This is so hard because you cannot erase. Oh my gosh, sometimes less is more. Whoo! Three. Two, one. This is for all the marbles. This is all it. Right. This is the last round. Let's start with Matt. Oh, wow. All right. Right in the middle. Here we go. So my shark is leaping out of the water, <laughs> and he is ready to knock the smack out of the Monopoly man who's riding a motorcycle. Oh, He's I don't believe that man has ever seen a motorcycle. <laughs> That's what I was saying. It's basically actually, well, no, it kind of looks like a pit bike. It's a sea dew. <laughs> it's a sea dew with wheels. <laughs> Guys, drawing is hard. He's so showing. this, this oh is a uh, shark wow. jumping a motorcycle through a fiery wow. hoop. There's a basketball. No, he's, he's jumping the basketball over the, the basketball court for scale to punch. Tattoo stories with his <laughs> boxing glove. Wow. Baby. Yeah. Whoa. To say I saved best for last is an understatement. It is you finally crazy. learned how to play the game. I was just getting your expectations low and then knock well, it out of the park. That's how to draw a shark. I want you so to forget everything out of the you park. think you know about sharks jumping motorcycles through flaming oh, hoops. And a shark jumping a flaming motorcycle through a A flaming hoop. motorcycle? Whoa. Whoa, Dang. your shark is good. That's different perspective. I put though. the gills on. Is it. he saying? He's saying that's life. Oh, that's, life. <laughs> that's the game of life. How is he gonna fit through that hoop? Or is it's it really a, far away? It's it's perspective. Okay. But yeah, the the boxing gloves got a little lost in the fray, admittedly. The board game. Where's oh, that's, that's life. life. Dang. That's life. Yeah, that's good. Wow. Pretty Baby. Good. That's pretty damn All good. All right. So mine is a shark standing a on a flames. motorcycle. Those shark boobies. He is going over uh, a flame here. And he has boxing gloves because he's punching the. Are earth. those ass cheeks yeah. on a shark? Um, <laughs> those are his legs. I've never <laughs> drawn a shark oh, in legs. my life. Legs on so a shark. So he's a yeah, leggy shark. shark. From and the then Cambrian also, era. we leggy noticed there are uh, like um, those dye that we used in our video we shot last week, and uh -huh. also people use it for D and D. So they're also like spraying through the air. The dye. Wow. Dice. Okay, so I drew also a shark Whoa. on a motorcycle. I like those biceps. Yeah. The shark is wearing boxing gloves. Like he's on his way to give you a little. Knuckle sandwich, and oh, he's yeah. saying, Checkmate! Oh. Because you can't beat him. That's a good shark. Yeah, I'm, I'm yeah. kind of mad at how good that is. And the motorcycle's <laughs> really good, too, with the seat and yeah. everything. It's got a little Thank perspective. You. It yeah. was hard. It was yeah, not three easy. Three quarter angles. See, this is, this is how it's going to go right here. Jumping, hands down, has to go to Ian. Ian. Uh, wow. I mean, just the biggest mm -hmm. air. Yeah. Shark, very easily to court. Yeah, yeah. 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 I mean, yeah. although I'd love to see a shark. With ass cheeks. Yeah. Motorcycle. They would alert the other because fish. These are both very good motorcycles. Thank you. That's what I was saying. Uh, <laughs> I was, so I'm going to go ahead and give that. Thank Corey. you. 
Samoa. Board game reference, there were a lot of good references. You know, reference my favorite here. The the D8s yeah. were really clutch because I love me some D&D. &D. That's so cute. These were great, but I automatically, I already told you all about talking animals. I can't confuse people. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's true, yeah. that's true. So that easily goes to the Monopoly reference. Wow. Oh. Boxing gloves. boxing gloves. What's left here? Because everything is so good, I have to go with the boxing gloves that are connected to the best biceps. And that means... Whoa! Making Thank coordinated you. Oh! Very nicely done. Guys, that has been Tattoo Stories. And if you guys want to play Tattoo Stories, you can. Link in the description. You can buy it on Amazon right now. So click that link. Tell us who did the best. Who had the best drawings? Mine. I Honestly, anybody. It could be literally Little any one salami. of us. So please let us know in the comments below. Big thanks to Games by Bicycle for sponsoring this episode. Thank you so much. We hope we get to do more of these. Let us know if there's other things you want us to do in the comments below. And also, hey, we got two videos here that you guys can watch. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ready, ready. Whoa, ready. And if you want to show us your tattoos that you're creating at home, you can do hashtag draw tattoo on social and we'll see it. Yes. Yeah, so and one of us might just get that said tattoo. Maybe, almost, maybe, Courtney's maybe. Courtney's going to get all of them. Yeah. Her mayhaps. Peace.